Welcome to your favorite weekly digest. All last week's cybersecurity news in less than five minutes. Iranian APT collaborating with ransomware groups. An advisory from U.S. agencies revealed that the Iranian group Fox Kitten has been involved in intrusion attempts on U.S. organizations, collaborating with ransomware groups such as ALPHV and Ransom House since 2017. These actors have gained domain control and sold access to other threat groups. Cryptojacking attack on Atlassian Confluence servers. Trend Micro discovered cryptojacking malware targeting Atlassian Confluence servers. This attack exploits unpatched vulnerabilities to hijack server resources and mine cryptocurrency. Additionally, BlackBite ransomware has been attacking VMware ESXi servers. Cyber attack disrupts Seattle Tacoma Airport. A potential cyber attack caused disruptions at Seattle Tacoma International Airport, impacting flight information displays, check in systems, and baggage handling. The FBI is currently investigating the incident. Microsoft Sway exploited for QR code phishing. A new phishing campaign has been observed, leveraging Microsoft Sway to host fake websites designed to steal Microsoft 365 credentials. QR codes are embedded in emails to trick victims, exploiting cloud services for malicious purposes. NGATE Android Malware Researchers discovered the NGATE malware, which targets contactless payment systems by cloning credit card data from victims' phones using NFC technology. This malware is spread through phishing attacks that direct users to malicious banking sites. Avis car rental attackers accessed one of Avis's business applications, stealing customer data, including names and possibly more sensitive information. Avis has offered credit monitoring services to affected customers. CBIZ, a well-known business services provider, recently experienced a significant data breach. In this incident, hackers managed to steal the personal data of nearly 36,000 individuals. This sensitive information included names, social security numbers, and even health information. Microchip technology. Employee data was stolen during an attack linked to the Play Ransomware Group, affecting several manufacturing facilities. Rollbar hackers stole customer access tokens and accessed sensitive data, including usernames, email addresses, and project data. Now, let's look at last week's CVEs list, sorting the vulnerabilities with a CVSS score higher than 8.5. CVE 2024-40711, Veeam Backup and Replication. CVSS 9.8, a critical unauthenticated remote code execution vulnerability that allows attackers to execute arbitrary code, potentially compromising entire systems. CVE 2024-7261, Zixel Routers, CVSS 9.8, OS Command Injection Vulnerability in Zixel Routers and Access Points, Enabling Remote Command Execution, CVE 2024-42-24, Veeam 1, CVSS 9.1, allows attackers with low privileges to perform remote code execution on host systems, CVE 2D24-42019, Veeam 1, CVSS 9.0, exposes NTLM hash of service accounts, enabling privilege escalation. Thanks for tuning in. Subscribe to the YouTube channel to stay up to date on all new content. Take care. Talk to you soon.